All right, so it's the 27th of September today, and yesterday Kenji came out. Now, I didn't want my debut video to be, or my return video, should I say, to be talking about kind of a negative, but also a bit of a constructive feedback. So Kenji just got released, as I said, and I was potentially looking at whether I wanted to buy Kenji early now. This has been a bit of a theme for a while, where in Brawl Stars you can get early access to brawlers like a week early before the next season starts and in this case obviously now it's kenji i will say that the only one positive that i think i've noticed they've done from last month is that previously when you bought a brawler for some reason you were locked into getting all of the rewards for like seven days or whatever whereas it looks like and again you can see i haven't actually purchased kenji it looks like that's not going to be locked there i could be wrong it might actually lock you by days but it looks like you can have access to all this stuff um so if, if any of you have actually bought kenji you'll have to let me know but i personally think that if it is still locking it day by day that's pointless and if it is letting you have access to all of this and that's great now that's kind of where the good news for me really really ends um and now i'm going to come into a bit of a constructive feedback point really on all of this so the only brawler that i have purchased early was melody and i'm pretty sure that she was 20 pound when she came out i might be wrong and um, so there's definitely been an increase in price now when you actually look at this yes you get access to kenji early this might be a more appetizing for somebody that hasn't got all of the brawlers and so they just want to have access to kenji or whatever new brawler comes out for whatever reason they might like and they want to get them early right so that kind of makes sense but i think where this whole offer kind of falls flat on its face is that for your average joe schmo like me um who has actually got access to all the brawlers but is massively coin starved and i will be doing a video on that soon but is massively coin starved you will see that you don't get any coins here for 25 pounds we are not getting any coins we're getting 80 gems which to be honest is laughable and we're also getting bling which is also laughable now one thing that i've noticed is that it doesn't seem like you get okay so sorry you do you do get a different skin so you get the fruit samurai kenji which basically looks pretty much the same um but other than that like once you buy kenji i'm assuming he's level one because it doesn't say otherwise and so you've still got to spend all of that gold um, and all of the points to actually upgrade him and if you're like me the average joe schmo you haven't got any coins or you're really really struggling for coins so not only have you got to pay 24.99 to get kenji early but you are also going to have to pay a lot as well to get coins if you haven't if you're not already sitting on some or you're not you know you might be prepared to just wait until the season pass comes out and at that point i'd say well, if you're just going to wait until the season pass to fully upgrade him, then you might as well just wait until you unlock him. That's assuming that you have every single brawler. So the other thing that I think is really, really sneaky about this, and don't get me wrong, like £24.99 is a lot in this kind of game. Like, I do think that is very, very expensive. Um, it says that it's 40% off. 40% off what? Like, wh where, where is that coming from? Is that how much you'd have to buy him once this ends? And then it would work out way more expensive because... I don't know who's paying more than $24.99 for a brawler. Um, maybe they're just like adding up the whole collection in its entirety. Um, but no real indication of knowing how they've got to that 40%. The interesting thing about it is that it's almost like they know that if you buy Kenji, you're going to need car uh, coins and you're probably going to need some power points. I mean, most people that have been playing for quite a bit don't need power points. As you can see... Just from mine as an example, I'm sitting on 14,000 power points. I'm massively coin starved all the time. I can't remember a time I wasn't coin starved in this game. And right next to the Kenji pack is a power up pack for $16.99. It gives you 7,765 coins. I don't even think, and I might be wrong. Actually, I'm pretty confident I'm not wrong. That's not even enough to fully upgrade Kenji to level 11 and get him one star power, one gadget. Uh, and two gears you're not even going to be able to you know if you're if you're just trying to do it on that 7765 i'm pretty sure you're not gonna have enough money to do that which is just absolutely bananas um so you know it it's really disappointing like to not have any coins to just get given 
80 gems in the pack. I mean, 80 gems is worth a fiver. Okay, fine, whatever. I mean, it, you know, if they've kind of upped the, the, the price there, so it was like 20 quid before for a previous brawler. Someone have to comment below. Um, and now they're just shoving in gems, just kind of increase the price. So, I mean, it's not like you're getting any more value on the gems. Like, it could be like 120, 130. But I just personally think to not give... And again, if any of you guys are PowerPoint star, please let me know um, if it's the other way around for you. I mean, honestly, at this stage, like where I'm at in the game, where I've got every single brawler, uh, nowhere near maxed for all of them, I am massively coin starved. So like PowerPoints are just very, very uninteresting to me. And there's nothing I can do with them. It's just a dead weight. Um, but yeah, I just, I just think to not have any coins in this, which is the most valuable resource by far, in my opinion, is just a massive letdown um and i think that this this pack really is for the whales it's for the people that have got loads of money or have get massive fomo and really want to play him like i don't see 24 pound 99 worth of value here um i just don't see it so my ask would be in the future to actually provide more coins more power points you know maybe even just give a free gadget or a free star power with it you know you, you're basically charging people a ridiculous amount of money already so why not give them some extra value with that and um, if any of you has purchased it let me know if it's still locked behind day so if you have to wait each day to unlock all of this stuff or whether you just get you get to unlock it all i mean it doesn't say i'm pretty sure when i looked at the last um all our, I think it was Melody, to be honest, was the last one I looked at. Um, that was obviously locked behind days, and I'm sure it said it before you bought it. But, yeah, let me know. Um, yeah, so for any of you guys that have been subscribing for a while, sorry that I've been not around as much lately. Uh, life just gets in the way. Um, but I'm absolutely still playing Ball Stars in the background. For any of you that are in my club, you'll know that I'm still around, still kicking. And, um, yeah, you know. Feel free to stay tuned. And if you're new to this channel, I appreciate you checking it out. I will be uploading some more stuff. I've got quite a lot of different things. I suppose I've been trying to get to Legendary um, League in Ranked. And, um, well, as you can see, it's a, it's a bit of a struggle. Um, but it's not just uh, the randoms. It's me as well. So there's lots for me to learn. Uh, and obviously, like, the randoms don't help when they're, they're obviously not playing great. But... Um, it is one of them things. People obviously do get to Legendary and Master, so it is possible. So we are going to keep trying to trudge along and get there. Um, but for any of you guys that uh, obviously are struggling or you do need a little bit of a helping hand, feel free to check out the club. There'll be a link in the description for that with my club details. If there's a space open, which there will be because some people on the Krusty Cash were not pulling their weight. So those people are going to have to go. Other than that, I don't know about you, but my missus is definitely happy that the theme tune in the background has finally changed so it's actually not a bad little theme tune to be fair the <clears throat> the um the one that we had before was getting on everyone's nerves around me which was a spongebob theme so for any of you guys that obviously loved spongebob I'm, I'm pretty sure the themes kind of burnt you out by now especially if you've been on regularly but um yeah other than that I'll catch you in. I'm going to stop waffling because I'm just going on and I'll see you in the next one. See you later, guys. Peace.